Hi Pisces, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your reading from now until the end of October. Keep in mind that the timing is fluid, and this reading is for somebody, not everybody, okay? So this reading may not even be yours, okay? I mean, that's reality. It may or may not be for you. This is for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Don't try to make it fit. If it doesn't fit, then it's, just, it's not for you, okay? Pisces. This is for Pisces. Generally, I focus on love. We'll see whatever comes up. I focus on love. This is courage. Finding the courage to move forward. This is happy independence, abundance. There's incomplete. Somebody is feeling incomplete. There's a lack of closure in one situation. Somebody needs to find the courage to communicate. But they're not acting with integrity. Okay. We have a man here that's not acting with integrity. This man is cold and withdrawn. Not being very wise. Lack of commitment. Not wanting a commitment before. Probably. Definitely a feeling of unhappiness, discontent. Discontent being alone, perhaps. But this is happy independence. Maybe you're really happy being alone. This is a woman, so maybe we have a woman here who's quite happy being alone. Doesn't want a commitment. Somebody may not want a commitment. And somebody could be coming in, and you may be like, you know what, I'm good. Yeah, you're probably in a state of limbo, you know. Here you are. This card represents you. Stuck. Thinking. Thinking about a situation that still needs closure. Thinking about your independence. Thinking about your abundance. Thinking about what you're grateful for. Thinking about commitment. Or not commitment. Going back and forth on the issue. Do I want this or not? Do I want this commitment or do I not want this commitment? But you need to find strength, courage, willpower, discipline. Somebody's afraid to take a risk. Yeah, they are. Somebody is really afraid to take a risk. Now, I have to tell you that you're here. Here and here. These Both these cards represent you, right? So you're here. You have this fear of the unknown that is holding you back from your own happiness, right? I mean, that's what's going on here. And you're feeling empty inside. This is emptiness and this is emptiness. You're feeling empty inside while you're being stuck. Uh, you're, it's like you're afraid of attachment here. This is the master of non-attachment. The card represents you. You're afraid of this attachment. You're afraid to attach yourself to something. Afraid to be taken advantage of. Afraid to take a risk. You may be mentally exhausted from all this thinking that's going on. You are thinking so much about who you want to be committed to that it's causing you like a mental mental exhaustion and I, there's a lot of fears here and I feel like right now you may be confused you're going through a period of confusion I mean and enlightenment confusion and enlightenment so I mean enlightenment can con cause confusion so hey it is what it is right 
So it feels like you are probably needing to be wise and you're needing to make a logical decision in which you're not making a logical decision. Somebody's not being logical. It's like somebody's being treated unfairly here. There's unfair treatment here. Let's get some, some clarity. Let's get some clarity. What is this strength card? What is this strength card next to the lack of closure? Somebody needs to find the strength. To deal with something that's not over yet. This card fell out on my arm. I don't know if you can see it. It's like this. Somebody needs to find the strength to deal with something that isn't over yet. But they, they, uh, they lack faith. They're afraid to take a risk. Because of their fears. And then we were clarifying the... Strength card, we got the three of coins. That was the card on my arm. It's about communication, compromise, working together. It's about increasing your appreciation for another. But somebody is refusing to see things from a new perspective. Wearing a mask, pretending, protecting themselves. You're protecting yourself, aren't you, Pisces? Protecting yourself from attachment. Protecting yourself from the unknown. Fear of the unknown is big here. It really is. There's some hidden forces here, though. There are some hidden forces here. That are trying to, something is trying to push you, push you along. Something is trying to move you along. They're trying to get you to take that step. You have to make a decision here. You, what are you going to do? You have to make some sort of decision as to what direction you want to go. Seems like you've been holding something really close to you you're holding something really close and you're thinking about something else oh so we have a man we have a man here that doesn't have good intentions. He's gone cold and withdrawn. Unable to master his emotions. Definitely not thinking clearly. We have a man in this dynamic that is refusing to open his heart. Refusing to give his heart. Oh, Jesus. We have a woman who has a solid, stable, offer. We have a woman here who is very practical, devoted, Royal, responsible, generous, and grounded. This woman is holding a golden opportunity. She's holding the ace of coins. But this man is refusing to communicate. He's refusing to open his heart. He's refusing to take that step. 
He's afraid to take a risk. All that is needed is somebody needs to put in more effort. Somebody needs to work a little harder. There's an opportunity to go down a new path. You have to make a decision. Perhaps somebody thought the grass was greener on the other side. And you're in the process, Pisces, of making, making a decision. There's no doubt. In regards to a partnership, do you want to go back or do you want to move forward? That's what this is about. And you're really thinking, 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 thinking. You have options, right? You have options, two options. The past is on your mind heavily and there's no closure. There's a lack of closure. There is, I'm sorry to say. <coughs> and it's caused you, if you're a man, it's caused this, this man to really detach and withdraw. Going downhill fast. We have this woman, whether it's a Pisces woman or a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn woman, any woman in this mix. This is Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Whoever this woman is in this mix, she's grounded and she's solid and she's stable and she's got her shit together. Teamwork. Teamwork. We have a man here that is very much conflicted, mentally conflicted, about this woman, whoever she is. He has a choice between two paths. There's no doubt. There's an opportunity to take back control of this situation at this time. There is. That's what this card is. You have the opportunity to take back control of this situation right now, Pisces. But you're going to have to step out of your ego. <laughs> This is a card of ego, it is. To find that wish fulfillment that you really want beneath the surface. All is not as it seems, right? All is not as it seems. I think that this is a secret. Somebody here is keeping a secret. About what their wishes are. And you know at this point. You may be thinking. Because I see all the thinking, 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 thinking constantly. It's like eating you alive. You may be thinking. I just want to be happy. I don't want to deal with this conflict anymore. I, don't, I just want to be happy. Why do I even need to prove myself? I don't need to prove. There's nothing to prove. There really isn't anything to prove here. There really isn't. Nah, there isn't. But somebody is reluctant to take action. Because, and all they're doing is thinking about it. Think, think, think. No action. There's no action being taken. In regards to what you really, really want. Your wish fulfillment. There's no action. But uh, still, there's something going on behind the scenes. There's a woman here that is given up. There's a woman here that is letting it go. 
she is beginning to realize that there's a better opportunity. So it looks like she's about to let that cup fall and crash because she knows even though it hurts it's not what she wanted this woman it's not what she wanted it's not take a look at her she's she's in despair she's not happy that she has to let this go but that opportunity for love is waiting for her to accept it. <coughs> oh, so we have a cancer here. So it looks as though somebody's moving in <laughs> and they're coming in fast and furious for this woman. There's somebody coming in fast and furious for this woman. You see where I put it? <clears throat> if you are a Pisces man, your woman is about to be swept off, taken away by somebody that can master their emotions and can take the lead. If, if you are a woman, the Pisces woman, be prepared for somebody to come in and sweep you off your feet. <coughs> somebody is coming in. We have a man here that is very controlling. You see where I put that one? Manipulative. Narcissistic. That is no longer on top. This man is no longer on top. He's on the bottom. He's falling down. He's going to fall. Mm -hmm. And the truth is about to be revealed. The Seven of Swords reverse. Somebody's about to get caught. You may feel like you've been robbed when this comes to when the reality sets in. When reality sets in, you may feel like you have been robbed. That's what thinking does for you. Reluctant to move in a new direction. Staying stuck wherever you've been stuck for so long. Not taking any action. Will not bring you the wish fulfillment. Somebody, we have a man here that's clinging to control. Narcissistic tendencies. And we have a woman that is seeing the situation absolutely clearly and has decided to defend herself. It looks like she's about to cut this narcissist out of her life and hop on board this chariot.
because this man is not communicating, is not taking action, is hanging around doing nothing. And somebody else is charging in. So Pisces. Pisces woman. Somebody is coming in. Because you have taken back your power and you're seeing the situation clearly. Be prepared for somebody to enter your life fairly quickly. And accept that opportunity that you have, that you're offering them. This person is going to see what you have to offer. If you're a Pisces man, you have to make a choice. Perhaps between two women, an air sign and an earth sign. Communication is needed and somebody's about to get stolen. Because you haven't taken action. By a fellow water sign at that. By the looks of things. By a brother. So, could be an air sign though. But I think it's a, I think it, I mean. I think it's a, we have this cancer here or this, somebody is charging in to, to the rescue. We have a, somebody, a man that is coming to rescue a woman. So, if you are the Pisces woman, you have a rescuer on the way. If you are a Pisces man, your woman is about to be stolen. The one that you are dreaming about. The woman that you want to be happy with. The woman that you are afraid to commit to is about to be stolen. Flirt. Extend your light-hearted energy to others. Getting to know each other. As you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. Go ahead, Pisces woman. Allow this person into your life. Or whoever the woman is that's watching this. The woman in this dynamic... If she's an earth sign or a fire or an air sign or fi any sign, the woman that is watching this reading, go ahead. Do it. Because whoever it is that isn't taking action, Is it about to experience a loss? You're probably receiving, this woman is receiving communication from somebody. See, the communication is connected to her. She's re, we have a woman that is watching this reading right now that is receiving communication from somebody that wants to get to know her.
You're being called if you are a man, because this is a man. If you are a man, you are being called to take action. Put yourself in that driver's seat. Stop thinking about it. Do it. Replace fear with faith. Take a risk. Go after the woman that you want, that you're dreaming about with that wish. Go after. Do it. Like I said, with that devil reverse, you have the power to take back control of this situation right now. But if you sit back and think about it, if you're a man, if you sit back and just think, 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 and don't take any action, we have another man or person that is going to steal your thunder. They're going to steal your woman. And it's going to be a loss. And right now, while you're thinking about it, it may not be a big deal. But eventually, you're going to see that you got robbed. Because you didn't move. You didn't make a move. Miracles and blessings. Everything has its gift. The heart of the matter. There is more going on than meets the eye. Recognize what this is all about. You know what this is all about. We all know what this is all about. Fear of attachment. That's what I have Pisces for the end of October. For the Pisces woman, there is somebody charging, or any woman that's watching this, it could be the cross watcher, that's watching for a Pisces man that isn't communicating. There's a woman that is about to be swept off her feet. And there's a man that needs to shit or get off the pot again, still. He just sitting around thinking, trying to prove himself, trying to prove a fucking point. Point's been proven. Good luck.